Let's start these breaks. eBay breaks! Real quick today. Uh, only two eBay breaks to do. We have 1718 Ascension Basketball, number 30. Uh, and that is a six bucks break right now. Uh, Lu Louise, I, I don't think you heard me the first time. It's at checkout, Louise. You have to be at checkout. All right. I, I wonder if I can. I don't think I can show you on my end. But it's at checkout. Like when you go, I, I can't stress this enough. When you go to check out before you actually submit the purchase. There is a code at the bottom that says gift code. It'll, it'll say gift code or discount code, something to that nature. But that's where you put the code in. Kigo, do we accept fan mail? I mean, I guess. I mean, sure, if you want to send us some, uh, some fan mail, that'd be cool. Definitely balance, you know, help balance out the hate mail that we do get from time to time. So, yeah, sure, why not? Send us some fan mail. All right, sorry about that. I had some uh, technical issues, as you can see here. Need to buy another little uh, stand. This thing's falling apart. I can also notice that my settings have been trifled with. What the heck? Well, that's kind of cool. <laughs> All right, anyway, let me see here. Okay, that's wrong. Uh, put that on. That's right. And the focus. Boom. Perfect. Uh, yeah, ripcitycards at gmail.com is our email, Kigo. But here is uh, Ascension right now. Let's get to it. There is uh, one autograph per box in this stuff, if I'm not, uh, if I'm not mistaken. Yep, one auto per box on average. 1718, good draft class. Very good draft class, as a matter of fact. So let's see what we can get up out of here. So yeah, Louise, it's at checkout, like I said. Like right before you actually submit the purchase, I'm trying. I don't think I can do it on my end, but let me see. I'm just gonna put something in my cart here and see what happens. Okay, Louise, are you are you still here? All right, so Louise, I'm gonna put a pause to this just to show you real quick. It's super simple. So this is our cart, right? You know, just go home or whatever. All right, so that, j -Mess, I don't think that's the question she has. So this is, let's say this is the front page, right? Because it is. You check your cart, you know, go to checkout. Once you're at checkout, you know, you can check out as a guest. Let's put that. I got to put all that crap. All right, I really don't feel like doing all that. So there is another way. You can view your cart, all right? So instead of checkout, go to view cart. When you view your cart, you see down here, follow my mouse. You see where it says gift card, use gift card to check out. Click on that box, enter your gift card there, then you apply the gift card. Once all that's done, it should apply to this, then you just proceed to checkout, all right? Also keep in mind that the gift code does require a minimum purchase of $25. So there's also that. What's up, JMS? How's your uh, Monday going? Let's see what we have here in this, though.
let's put that as a rookie variation. Brandon Ingram has been a, a bit of a bust, in my opinion. They should have traded that guy. Anthony Davis right there. That is correct, Kigo. We are uh, streaming live from Miami, Florida. To 299, Cal Kuzma. The on card autograph. Very nice. That's not cool, JMS. Yeah, uh, Kigo was just telling me how uh, he can't even leave the house because there's so much snow. I don't know how you guys do it, man. You you guys are you guys are soldiers. Bobby Porter's 125 Bulls. You know, there's a reason why I live in Miami. I just, man, I, I cannot deal with the cold. I'm all about the warm weather, baby. Justin Jackson of 50 for the Kings. Alrighty. Let's get some organization here. So what are these? Okay, it's nothing. Inserts over here. Let's put the rookies there. Inserts there. Base cards there. Awesome. 40 degrees would be summer. Oh, no. Like, it gets 40 degrees in Miami. Maybe, maybe, maybe like one or two days here and there. And that is considered freezing for us. Like, that is absolutely freezing. 40 degrees? Dude, if it ever gets to 40 degrees and under in Miami, we, we, we start to lose our mind. We just, we don't know what to do. Like right now, it's 77 degrees in, in Miami. Later tonight, it'll probably drop to like 69 or something. But 77 degrees, that's like perfect Miami weather. You know, you still got the sun beaming on you, but at least you have a little bit of breeze. Yeah, I haven't, dude, I haven't gone to the beach in a while. Might need to uh, go to the beach one of these days. Although, you guys might get tired of me. I do not have a day, I do not have a single day off this week. Uh, Jason's little baby girl, it's her second birthday, I believe. Penny's turning two on the 15th, I believe. So he has, you know, he has family in town and blah, blah, blah. So I'm going to be live for like the next two weeks straight. I don't know how I'm going to do. I don't know how I'm going to do that. <laughs> so hopefully I don't lose my mind in the process. We did put some more stuff in the store. We put some hockey coins in the store, some mosaic basketball from 1617. Uh, We're giving away the Sixers in that, Ben Simmons rookie cards. And we also have Panini uh, plates and patches in the store. Jason told me that uh, we're going to get some more Panini 1, uh, but that won't be until Wednesday, apparently. Uh, supposedly, so we'll see about that. Donovan Mitchell, back-to-back big-time rookies. This kid should have been Rookie of the Year last year. To 299, very nice. I do not, Kigo. I do not collect cards. Uh, but, you know, we have pretty awesome customers who know that I'm a big Dolphin fan and Heat fan. So, sometimes we'll get, like, we'll, we'll get customers that'll be like, Hey, Jesse, keep that card. It'll be like a Dwayne Wade card or something, and they let me keep it, which is pretty fucking cool. Marco Fultz to 25 Sixers, but personally, I've never gone out and, like, bought a, a pack of cards or, like, anything off of eBay. You know, it's, it's just not my cup of tea. But if you want to give me stuff for free, I'll take it all day. 
and I will cherish it. Like some dude gave me a Dwayne Wade Prism autograph, and that thing is gorgeous, and I, I'm going to keep it probably forever. Kelly Oubre Jr., 75 Wizards. You know, I'm a big soccer fan too, so one of our uh, one of our longtime customers, who's a friend of mine, he let me keep this uh, Carlos Valderrama autograph. So, a matter of fact, my little collection is here on the side. I kind of want to put it up on the uh, on this little table that we have here. But like, here's the D Wade autograph I was talking about. Dude just straight up just gave it to me. He's like, here, man, a gift. eBay 101, too. 150 out of 150 from Prism Basketball, no less. So, I got here's the Immaculate uh, Balderrama card that he gave me. As you can see, my doll rocking the Afro. He's uh, one of the reasons why I actually rock the Fro. So, we, we have pretty awesome people, man. Speaking of Prism... Somebody gave Jason this card right here, a Tracy McGrady, a uh, Prism Autograph for the Magic. Jason's a big uh, T-Mac fan. And then we have little funky stuff like this. That is Nadia from the American Pie series, a.k.a. Shannon Elizabeth. Customer, let me keep that. I'm also a big Dolphin fan, so Minka Fitzpatrick. You know, they let me keep that. Somebody sent me this Kenyon Drake uh, rookie. RPA right there for the Dolphins. So that's pretty awesome. I guess you could say those are the cards in my collection. It's not much of a collection, but, you know, it's it's mine. Cool stuff. I can't complain. Our fans are awesome. We got the best in the game. But anyways, let's continue with this stuff. This is box three. Well, JMS, I mean, you know, I, I do have stuff in the collection here and there. I just choose my battles, you know, very, very, very carefully. What sport do I like better, baseball, soccer, football, or basketball? I would have to say basketball is my favorite sport. But I love soccer, too, a.k.a. the real football. So if I was to rank all those sports there, I would put basketball at the top. At a very, very close second, I would put soccer. Then I would put football, American football, and then baseball last. I, I like all the sports, though. But if you're asking me which I prefer, I do prefer basketball. What about you, Kigo? Something tells me you're uh, you're a baseball fan. JMS, I don't think I ever asked you, but what is the uh, what is your favorite, uh, or I should say, what's the biggest card you have in your collection? JMS, a big hockey fan. That's your favorite sport. So what's the biggest uh, thing in your collection? Kigo, big baseball fan. There you go. Baseball's coming up. It's like a month away, you know? I think uh, catchers and pitchers are reporting soon or something like that. I don't know. I just regurgitate whatever uh, ESPN tells me. Most expensive or whatever you consider is the nicest. Russell Westbrook, 125 Thunder, your favorite card. So, Louise, uh, did did you, uh, did my instructions help you at all? Or did you just ignore me like the rest of the women in my life? Iwundu Magic Rookie. Frank Nilakina, 129 Knicks. Carmelo Anthony. I hear he's trying to come back and play for somebody. He should just call it quits. 
honestly. Play zero defense. Wow, are you kidding me? Three straight boxes. First box, Kuzma. Second box, Donovan Mitchell. Third box, Jason Tatum. Oh, man. Hot. Three of the biggest rookies right there coming back to back to back. Holy crap. Well, Louise Cook, why would you have one? I mean, yeah, any break credit that you should have, we would email it to you. Uh, little spoiler alert, Louise, you're probably looking for that break credit from last night, correct? From that Series 1 Jumbo number 5? If my, uh, if my deduction is correct, there you go. JMS is absolutely right. I forgot. I did not send that email out. So, yeah, Louise, that's probably why you haven't found it. Because I haven't sent it. Let me finish this break, and I'll go ahead and do that, uh, Louise. It'll be in your email, though. So, I, I will email it to you. No problem, Weezy. All right, what do we have here? Man, the Heat had a close game last night. I don't know if anybody saw basketball, but we could have. We had a chance to beat the Warriors at the crib, and we came up short as we usually do. But you know, something tells me we're just gonna play the rest of this season out. Once D Wade retires, and that era is over and done with, Pat Riley's gonna make a move for something. Like I just, I have a feeling. I wouldn't be surprised if Kyrie wears a Heat uniform next year. Rudy Gobert, 125 Jazz. I do think Kyrie's not going to re-sign with the Celtics. I, don't, I think he's gone. Maybe the Heat somehow make a maneuver. Bring Anthony Davis and Kyrie Irving to Miami. That would be awesome. Kigo doing self-promotion? Look at you. Not cool, but hey, I, uh, you're in fifth grade. I'm not going to hold that against you. DJ Wilson is 75 bucks. James Harden putting all his efforts in to be eliminated in the first round of the playoffs, more than likely. I kind of feel bad for the guy, but, like, not really. All right, what's this redemption? It is Laurie Markkinen. Laurie Markkinen, rookie ascent, card number seven. That is a Bulls hit. Congrats, Bulls. Two boxes left. So far, all four rookies have been big time rookies. The Heat play tonight again against the Nuggets. So that's going to be another big game, another big test for us. Let's see what we do. Kareem Hunt to the Browns, though. That's interesting. I wonder what's going to happen there. What's up, David? Jeremy Lin is trying to make moves to sign with the Raptors. How's everything with you, uh, David?
see what we have here. Derek White to 299. Spurs, solid, solid player. There you go, hit for the Spurs. Cooking that dinner. Which reminds me, I haven't eaten today. But I did bring some food. Kali Stein, 125 Kings. I'll get my grub on at some point tonight. Just some uh, grilled chicken and some uh, and a, a little salad there. Tony Bradley, 129 Jazz. Well, Louise, honestly, I, I, I'm i the wrong person to ask about that stuff. My partner, Jason, handles all of that. So I, I really don't know until like he tells me, hey, dude, I'm putting this in the store. And then five minutes later, it's in the store. So unless, unless he gives me a go-ahead, I don't really know. But I can tell you this, Louise. As far as new products are concerned, we usually always get a case or two. As long as it's not Upper Deck, we don't have a physical store, so we don't get Upper Deck products. But if it's a new release, like for example, Plates and Patches comes out on Wednesday. We already have it in the store, so if you want to go ahead and pick up your team, you can do so. Um, Leaf Flash Football comes out on Friday. I'm not sure if we're going to get any of that stuff, uh, but we usually do. We usually do get new products, so... Unless they tell me otherwise. And that's usually like the day of or the day before or something like that. My job is to fill breaks. Fill breaks and put a, you know, and put a smile on my face. And be happy, go lucky, you know, full of energy, Uncle Jesse. That's my job. So... Beyond that, Last box mojo. Let's see what we got, yo. Good luck, everyone, especially those without a hit. Let's see what I can do for you. Nice. Lakers did work. Two rookie autos for them. This one is Josh Hart of the Lakers right there. So I would say five of the six uh, autographs were pretty big time. No disrespect to Derek White, who's a solid NBA player, but he's not on the other rookies' levels to be, you know, in, in my personal opinion. Rally Beal, 125 Wizards. Malik Monk Hornets rookie. It's another good rookie right there. It just sucks that he's playing for Charlotte, and that organization is going nowhere. And that is Michael J uh, Michael Jordan's franchise, so I wonder how he feels about how he feels about that. His team is either eliminated first round of the playoffs, or they just don't even make it. Justin Patton, one twenty nine Timberwolves. You know, most former players make terrible coaches or like front office people. I find that kind of funny. You would think a former player would be awesome at, 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 at any role in a basketball organization. But hey, what do you know? That's it for the break. So, to recap, Laurie Market and Bulls Redemption. Josh Hart Lakers to 299. Derek White Spurs 299. Jason Tatum 
uh, Celtics 299, Donovan Mitchell, Jazz 299, and Kyle Kuzma, Lakers 299. Pretty freaking good half caser, if you got a hit, that is. But that's going to do it. Thank you very much. We'll get it out to you.